Alright, welcome back to my let's play of Blood Omen, Legacy of Cain. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. We are here again in the Light Shrine, where we seem to start out so many of our episodes. If you recall, last time, Cain was doing some... Last couple episodes, just trying to get... He was trying to do some, you know, kind of like resource app gathering. We went and did some backtracking. Vey Victus! Let's see. I haven't played this game in like about three and a half weeks. I've uploaded in that time, but haven't played. So I just need to make sure I'm knowing my buttons, basically. Alright, so yes, Kane was doing some backtracking, gathering spells and resources and exploring with his newfound powers, the mist form and what have you. And he gained some powerful stuff, some pretty nasty spells, I would say, that, that inspire hatred spells. Quite terrible. But nonetheless, that all that said, it's now time to get back on the search for the lair of Vorador, the ancient vampire who once defeated Malak. So let's go. We will fly. Let's see, is that... Alright, yeah, see, we can go to Vordor's man mansion, but I don't really want to just skip the forest. So let's go to the forest. And we'll journey through the terrible swamp. <laughs> if for no other reason, then I'm stubborn as all heck. All right, let's see. We need our sword. Yes. All righty. And we have the deflect spell on. Ah, that's as good as anything, I suppose. Wait, wait, where are we? Oh, yes, this is fine. Yes, if you recall, that is the little shrine where we found the uh, mist form in. And up there is the way... Toward, back towards where the Oracle of Nazgoth was. There's some nasty enemies around here, so let's um, try to be careful. Uh, like right here. Hey, Victor! <laughs> Got hit. There's some, like, weird turrets. It's just weird. It's like, why are these here in the road? Did Vordor put these there to dis discourage interlopers? What? <laughs> All right. Worked him over. And how? Ah. All right. Let's. <laughs> I say it, our sword is beginning to show its limits. Wouldn't you? Now, if you recall, we... Let's see. The Black Forest reigned here. Its kingdom rarely invaded by those that live in the light. But it was called home by this mysterious Vorador. Legend Vorador. told of a time when Vorador defeated Malek of the Seraphan. If such a man did exist, then he could perhaps be the key to defeating the ward. Alrighty. Yep. That's his manor there, that, there in the swamp. So let's take a look. What are we dealing with? What can our power scry? Oh, wow, weird. I wonder where that goes, right? Now, obviously, this is more the direction we need to go. Not this way, perhaps, but... We might want to. Hmm. I think we need to go down this way. <laughs> All right. So let's turn into our mist form. 
again, I'm reminded of the spirits in, whoa, jeez, that one game, uh, Stella Days, when he's in his mist form. What was over here? Anything? No, nope, maybe not. No, no. I really wonder if there's anything over here. Probably not. So let's just go. If there is, we can revisit it. All right, we gotta watch out for that turret. Jeez Louise, oh my gosh. What in the living crap? What is this? Let's actually get our axes out. The axes. Yes, the axes. What in the world are these things? Can we kill them? I'm the, gonna dodge it. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> ah, here's the music for the forest. Pretty cool, right? <coughs> Oof. What hit me? Let's do some, you know. Oh, maybe that? Or maybe that's murky water, like bog water. Well, there's the igneous fatuous that the, the oracle told us about. That lights the path to hell. Your path, Cain. Alright, let's just take a look at what we're dealing with. There's a cave up there. A bunch of ruins. I guess we're supposed to go over here to the right, but there's a lot of stuff to look into it along the way not least of all right in front of us in our near vicinity jeez all right well this music's really awesome oh jeez there is a Ah, uh, well, so much. The heart pain. of darkness. The heart of darkness. <laughs> I got wasted. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hmm. Zombie pushed Kane onto the into the water. Hey, Victor! Man, that is that's Hey, Victor! That's tough. <laughs> okay, okay, calm down. Calm down. <laughs> Let's take a look at our map. So this is going to be dangerous no matter what we do. I see. Man. Alright, there is a little... This is a nasty place, I'd say. Let's go look at this cave. The blood of ages oh, nice. flows so sweet. Come drink from us. Oh, hopefully these like water doesn't burn you anymore. <laughs> 
Your strength has increased, for our blood enhances. That'll work too. Alrighty. Hmm. Well, that was nice. That was quite, quite good. And then it boosts to Kane's strength. Some room to stand. And look, I think we can go down here now. I wonder if you can get anything down in this corner. There's a light over here, so maybe there's something. I just want to be able to explore this whole page, <laughs> this whole area. Careful, careful. Looks like there's going to be a lot of transforming in this chapter, <laughs> this area, you know, from one form to another. Right across the water. And down here. Anything up here? No. Ooh, yes, there is something here. And let's turn into the wolf. Hmm. Very nice. I love this music right here, right? Isn't it cool? Whew. Stop burning yourself, wolf. It has something of the same martial, um, like, mood or tone as, what's his face, Malak's music, which kind of makes sense in a way since Vordor and Malak are arch nemesis, 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 <laughs> <laughs> and those things are annoying. <laughs> I, I think the main danger they pose is not their own attack, but rather damage. Rather the fact that they can push Kane off into the water, as you saw before. Let's try going down here, and then we'll go over to this tower right here. So let's turn into the mist form. Ah oh, yes, something is right down here. Indeedy. And we'll just go. <laughs> ah, the igneous fatuous. The igneous fatuous likes the way to hell, woman. Your path, Kane. That's really cool. Let's actually uh, uh, go in here. Oh, jeez. <coughs> Let's actually switch weapons. There's some dudes in here. Man, you guys are bold. <coughs> I thought I'd switch. Come on. Bay <coughs> Victus! <coughs> <coughs> I'm gonna switch. No, let's switch item to something else. Yeah, reflect. I wonder what's here. I don't remember at all. Oh, there's a safe spot, is what is here. Oh my goodness gracious, thank goodness. All of, well, this actually may be what we do today on this episode is this shrine, which is fine. Oh my goodness, I wonder what we're gonna get. Something cool, no doubt. Pretty much everything in this game is cool. In one way or the other. And that brings up an interesting point, because I've said a lot of these things are terrible and horrible. And I don't mean, uh, like they... they, they, they Bay Victus! That they're not useful or uh, have their aesthetic appeal. 
but rather that they're just you know either moralistically or uh just ethically or metaphysically Ooh, terrible what is this looks delightful this spell allows me to use blood from my own body as a weapon when struck, my enemy's blood would flow from their bodies to fill me with life. Tis a risk, yet the rewards are a temptation. Weird. I sort of remember this, but not quite. Okay, there's a... Are we going to be needing to use this to get out of here? Okay, there's some people bound. Eh, we should probably... Eh... Let's just go see what we face first. Okay, we cannot get out of here. Where is the... Hmm. Do I burn on this? <coughs> yes, I do. Okay. No? Um, let's see. is the point of this? If I just drain her, what does that do? Okay. That did something. Let's go to the other one. Maybe we need to drain both of the prisoners. Well, it's better than... Uh, well, to the degree that we can do anything good than leaving him them here to just rot. Yep, that was the answer. Blood is the answer. <laughs> I guess. Makes sense. Vampires and all, but jeez. <laughs> oh, this is the music from, like, um, the beginning of the game. Fae Victus. Suffering to the conquered. Ironic. Now I was the one suffering. Nothing. Anything is pedestrian. <laughs> <laughs> pain. Rather. Steam of impotent anger. Victus! <sighs> the necromancer Mortinius offered me a chance for vengeance. And like a fool, I leapt at his offer. Nothing is free. Not even vengeance. <laughs> you shall have the blood you hunger for. <laughs> Let's just kill all these little weird things. Slimes. The ones that are in range. Then we'll go on. No, 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 no. Come on. I almost can play. Now let's see, what do we have in front of us? Help me, kind sir! Is that... very good? <laughs> that was great. Alright. Let's turn into a wolf. Does he look like a kind sir? He doesn't even look like a sir, much less a kind one. Looks like a weird half dog, half or half wolf, half whatever you call it. Human. Kind of grotesque, but really. let's see, what do we have here? Woo! Victus! 
Well done, dude, but, uh, um, not <laughs> <laughs> it never stops being fun. All right, let's turn into the again. And hoppity hop. No, 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 not that way. Ah. We'll try out the new spell, but when we have more, you know, controlled laboratory conditions. Not right now. Sacrificing blood and things that are a risk doesn't seem like a good idea when we're in a hostile, dangerous environment. This is such a great song. Man, really like this. <laughs> I love the chunks. <sighs> it's like tempting me to just blow her up, but it's like, I'm not going to do that. You know, be a proper vampire and not waste good blood. What would Kane say? Nope, we cannot get over there. Hmm. Well... Sorry. It'll be quick. <laughs> Sorry. Can't just leave you there. That's... Alrighty. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, a skeleton. Hmm. Can we blow the skeleton up? <laughs> Yes, we can. It's quite a powerful skeleton. Nope. I guess that was just the, the test. The, the barrier was that skeleton. Hmm, a skeleton warrior, probably. Hi. <laughs> You forget, I'm a bit of a magician. We're gonna have to try some of these other spells and items, not just the ones I'm super fond of, or used to. Although that worked really well. Ah, oh, good. There, I was wondering how the heck I was gonna get across. Alrighty. Hi, pal. <laughs> so much for you. Let's take a look at our map. Alright, I guess this is the way out. So, let's check out down here first. Ooh, good! More life! Our maximum life has increased. I'm going to actually equip our sword. Since these enemy types seem to be... There's not so many of the humans as he has these darn skeletons. Oh, jeez. Hmm. You know what we could do is equip this, use it, and then equip this. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, so great. Nope. Oh no. Just move. 
<laughs> oh. Okay, I'm, let's. I'm looking stupid. I'm getting my butt kicked. I beat a hasty retreat. I got totally outdone. Alrighty. Now let's move for the purpose. Can we kill him with his own spells? Yes, we can. Thank you. I sorry. I have to concentrate a little bit. <laughs> All right. Now let's re-equip our sword. I. Hey, Victus! <laughs> oh come on. Well, at least they don't seek you out. And there is more maximum magic. And here we are. Okay, let's try this again with the yeah, SU. <laughs> I didn't mean to hit the slime, I meant to hit him. So much for you. <laughs> Alright, so we'll grab the magic. Let's take a look at our. Ah, here we are. The way out. It's going to be difficult, I re reckon, to get out. <coughs> Man, those things hit hard. Alrighty. Is that a hint? I don't know, maybe not. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Stupid. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh, no. Sticky keys. I, I, I got sticky keys. The heart with. of darkness. Oh, man. Two fails in the same video. Run! Embarrassing. Oh jeez, wow, there's a, a spectral... ghost. Ah, <sighs> that was horribly embarrassing. Yes. <laughs> Terrible. I have to apologize for that. Utterly. Utterly. A substandard gameplay. My goodness. I, I I have to say, I panicked. And Sticky Keys got me again. I need to turn that off. I, I'll try to see if I can do that before the next time I play this game. But, on a better note, we did get the... Uh, <laughs> we did get the, the, the upgrade. So, the spell here. And we've begun our exploration of the forest. And on that note, I want to say thank you for joining me for this embarrassing, but, you know, productive, after fashion, episode of my Let's Play of Blood Orange, Legacy of Cain, here on my channel, Idol Wisdom. Next time, hopefully, I will be a little bit more back on top of things, and we will make more progress, and I will embarrass myself a little bit less. So, take care, y'all. <laughs> yes, let us hope you embarrass yourself a little less.